Hello guys, welcome back to my channel Cook with Naima. If you're new here, I'm Naima and I hope you're all doing okay. Without further ado, let's get started. So guys, before I introduce you the ingredients and the recipe, I'm going to fill a pan with water and put in the stove and bring to a boil. So guys, today I'm going to make la bouillie de mille and in English it's called mille porridge. So guys, this recipe comes from West Africa, but there are different ways to make it all over the world. Now, let's talk about the ingredients. So you're going to need ginger, sugar, of course, mille lumps, and tamarind so to make this recipe I'm using two utensils in wooden and I don't know if you guys know it but I'm sure that my African subscribers know it now I'm going to measure 200 grams of mealy lumps Make sure you add the mealy lumps only when the water is boiling and add it gradually in my boiling water. Right after adding the mealy lumps, I'm going to stir so that the lumps do not stick. I'm going to let it cook for 10 minutes. While it's cooking, I'm going to heat some water and grate the ginger. When the water is hot, I'm going to add it into the ginger and into the tamarind. Do not put too much water. Now, as you can see, I'm using a tablespoon to make the tamarind into pieces so that they can infuse well and faster. So guys, I forgot to show you this ingredient. It's mille flour and it was inside the mille lumps bag and I'm also going to use it for this recipe. So in a boil, I'm going to add a small quantity of mille flour. and add some cold water and mix it with a wooden spatula. After 10 minutes, the mealy lumps are cooked and I'm going to add her in my pan and stir again and let it cook for another 5 to 10 minutes. Also, I forgot to tell you that in the beginning, but you should not cover your pan while you are cooking the lumps. Okay, so after 5 minutes, I'm going to add the ginger juice and the tamarind juice using a colander and stir.
Millet is a cereal like wheat. It represents the main cereal consumed in several regions of Niger, Nigeria, Mali and Burkina Faso. Africa is the world leading producer of this cereal. Millet contains 11% of protein, the same rate as wheat. It is very rich in B vitamins, folic acid, calcium, iron, potassium, magnesium, and zinc. So now for the final step, you're going to add 100 grams of sugar. And stir. and let it cook for another 5 minutes and it will be ready. After 5 minutes, I stir one more time my pan and it's ready. I'm going to serve myself into a boil and enjoy my mealy porridge. Mealy porridge can be eaten in the morning as a breakfast or before the dinner. It really depends on the country. So that is all guys. I hope you like it. If you do so, don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe to my channel to see more content and I will see you in my next video. Bye!